Okay, Mr. Mix. One is the loneliest number that you'll ever do. Two can be as bad as one. Hello, everybody. My name is Max or Sithman36, and welcome to my video. Now, I was just getting used to 1.8. I had just figured out some of the new features, just getting started. Go on YouTube. Pacham! 1.9 came out. So, before I start making Let's Play videos and such with 1.9, um, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a 1.9 pre-release server. I did this with 1.8. I'm going to do it with 1.9. Maybe with 1.10. I don't know. But anyway, it's pretty much the same process as before for 1.8, except with the new link in the description. But I'll go through it for the guys who didn't see the old one, because I'm awesome. So uh, basically, you just download this thing that is in the description once again, and you'll get a little thing called... Oh, I dragged it out of my downloads bar. But you'll basically get this thing. It says Minecraft dash server dot jar it might be like parentheses one per stupid dog but you know what? i'm gonna shut him up okay i'm back and he will not shut up so we're just gonna continue like that never happened so get this thing download it now you double click it now what it's gonna say it's gonna say this it's gonna get about halfway through starting up the server and making the new world and then it's going to run out of RAM. See up here it says, warning, not enough RAM. So what you do is you take, okay, well, let's let it, let it fail quickly here. And it failed. Okay, so, oh my god, it's super laggy when it stops. But basically you go, okay, okay, what, what just, what just happened? What? It's not letting me type. <laughs> Why? Why did it do that? Okay. Pretend that never happened. You just take all the stuff here and you put it in a serp in a folder called server or whatever you really want to name it. It's right here. And you just put your stuff in there. These are just extra worlds I have for my server. Nothing. But as you can see, it's that stuff, it's that stuff. So and then what you do is you go into a thing called terminal you just go ter you guys know what terminal is i don't know what if you don't know what terminal is it's like command prompt for mac but you click it and this thing opens and you type cd space and you drag this folder you made into there you put the folder in the folder you not only put all these things and you also put that that thing the minecraft server dot jar and then you click enter and then you take the special code that's in the link in the description not the link, the description, and you do, and you copy it, and then you paste it in, and then you click enter, and there you go, the server has started, see, as you can see, there's enough RAM, let me just quickly enter it, just give me a minute here, oh my god, my dogs will not shut up, okay, just making a new world, okay, okay, why, why is that not, why is that not working? Okay. False alarm. Just restart the server. And everything should be dandy. Right? Sometimes it does that. In the pre-release servers, it's just some... It, you gotta get used to it. It's not... No one can control it. But it looks as if it has a successfully started up. Let me double click. And there you go! 1.9 server. Play with your friends. Have a jolly good time. Uh, find out all the new bugs, which it seems like there's more of the new features. But anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you, oh my god, like okay. If you did enjoy, please do leave a like and a favorite. If you haven't already, please subscribe. I make some other awesome videos. Go check out my other videos. Anyway, it's pretty much it. Now, I uh, instead of the normal goodbye and my normal. Sithman36, how to set up a video, uh, server videos. I'm going to make a special goodbye, which involves me taking this, 
Oh, as you can see right here, I'll just put this out here. When you jump, it makes, it makes you have a speed, but you just... Kawabunga! Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Bye.